This is Anil with a video tutorial for the learning layer on C programming. So in this video tutorial we're gonna see the loops in C. So this loop is used to you know execute some statements again and again in your program and you just have to write it only once. So in C there are three types of loops available. One is called for loop and another one is called while loop and another one is called do while loop so in this tutorial we're gonna see the while loop in detail so I'm gonna delete this and uh, I'm gonna copy and paste the syntax of this while loop so to use the while loop in your program first you have to write the keyword while then within this parenthesis you have to write an expression or some condition then within the curly braces you have to write the statements so as long as your condition or expression is true, your statements inside this while loop will be executed. So now we're gonna see how we can use this while loop in our program. So here for the demonstration purpose, we're gonna we're gonna print the value from 1 to 10. So for that we need to create a variable and I'm gonna call it as counter and I'm gonna initialize it with a value of 1. So next we're gonna write our while loop. It's gonna be while. So now within this parenthesis we need to write the expression or the condition. So here in this tutorial we just want to print the number from 1 to 10. That's why we're gonna check whether our variable counter is containing the value which is less than or equal to 10. If it is so then we're gonna print the counter value to the screen else we're just gonna come out of this while loop so we're gonna write this condition using a relational operator less than or equal to so if this counter variable contains a value which is less than or equal to 10 then we just want to print to the screen percentage d and refer this counter variable here so <coughs> as you can see here you know uh, in our program there is no way that you know this expression or this condition can become false that's because we have initialized this counter variable with a value of 1 and we're just checking here whether this counter variable is less than or equal to 10 so this is gonna be true forever that's why your program will be in some infinite loop so there's no way that you know this condition or this expression can become false and you can come out of this while loop so for that purpose you know we want this condition to be failed for some value of this counter that's why we are just gonna increment this we're gonna increment it by using counter plus plus so when this counter variable contains a value which is greater than or equal to 10 you know this expression or this condition is gonna be false and it's just gonna come out of this while loop so we're gonna save this compile it and run it so as you can see here we have printed the number 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so uh, let's have a recap so a while loop is used to execute some statements uh, again and again or repeatedly until some expression or some condition is uh, reached in your program so to use the while loop we have to write the keyword while then within this parenthesis we have to write the expression or the condition you know this you know if this expression or this condition is true then you're gonna execute these statements until this expression or this condition become false so here in our program we we first created our variable counter and we initialized it with a value of 1 then we printed the value which is stored in this variable counter uh, until this counter variable is less than or equal to 10 so within this while loop we just incremented the counter value to make this while loop to fail uh, when this counter value becomes greater than or equal to 10 so this is it this is about the while loop in C so thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe see you in the next tutorial